Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. My name is Ferdi Santiago and if it is your first time tuning in here, allow me to give you my warm welcome. Today's video is another requested look. This is like an ongoing thing now, which I am very happy to oblige by the way. So someone is going to this forest fantasy themed wedding and she requested for a look that would complement her emerald green gown and I thought, hmm, forest fantasy, how could I say no to that? So if you want to know how the magic happens, stick around and let's have some fun. I have already started preparing my skin using the Clinique Clarifying Lotion and then I'm going to continue that with the Vitamin Enrich Eye Base. And I'm also going to use the Essence from Augustine Spader, so a few drops of that. And for moisturizer, I will be using this one from Strokes. And then lip balm. And we're good to go. And as always, I will begin with the eyes first, but you are totally fine to begin with your foundation. This is just how I like to do makeup. So I will be using this uh, primer from NARS. So that's the primer done and I will begin with this color first using a flat brush. This is another limited edition palette but you never know, I might have another one to give away as well. <laughs> so I'm just gonna press that on my lids. So I'm just doing a pressing motion. And then using an angled brush, I will be using this matte taupe eyeshadow just to create definition. So just really keep blending it and keep diffusing it and then just slightly extending it. And then using a green coal liner, I am going to create a flick.
All right, so just really map the shape with that cool pencil. We're going to smudge it later with a darker eyeshadow, maybe black even, just to deepen it as well. So that is the shape pretty much mapped out and then I will be using this metallic, it's not metallic, it's actually matte based eyeshadow with glitter. So it's black, it's called Black Tide from MAC using a flat tipped small brush. And then going back in with this slanted brush, I'm just going to blend that taupe eyeshadow to sort of meet the tip of that flick. There. Yeah. Right, so the eyeshadows are now pretty much done and I'm just cleaning any fallout. And then I will be good to move to color correcting and concealing and foundation. For color corrector, I will be using this one from Bobbi Brown. And for concealer, I will be using this one from Bobbi Brown as well. So this is the Skin Concealer Stick. Alright, so that's the concealer done. And now for foundation, I will be using this one from Lisa Eldridge. foundation is really good. Of all the foundations that I've used, and I've used a lot, this is by far has the best tone match on me. Like, I don't need to adjust it. It's perfect. Mm -hmm. 
but then again it's made by Lisa Eldridge so you can't expect anything less than perfect from her right so that's done and for highlighter I will be using the elevated glow from Lisa Eldridge as well this is the cosmic rose For blush, I will be using this one from Surat. Right, so while I'm allowing all those cream and wet products to set on my face, I'm just going to do my lashes now. So I'm just going to curl first and then mascara. And then false lashes. For mascara, I will be using my favorite, the DHC. So that's my lashes done with my trusty Divisoria lashes and now I am going back in with this taupe eyeshadow with a pencil brush and I'm just going to run that on my lower lash line for a bit of definition. For powder, I will be using this one from Hourglass. For a bit of contouring, I will be using this one from Surat. I'm going to begin with the highlighter first, just on top of that cream blush. And using the same product still, I will be doing some nose contour. Actually, ako talaga yung aabay eh. Ni Echos ko lang kayo. Charot.
but I'm using these three products from Stroke. So I'm using the Brow Sculptor first to create density on my brows. And then moving to the brow painter. And then I'm going to set that with a brow fixer. Then I'm also just gonna use this hourglass blush on top of the Surat one just to amplify it a bit. For lips, I will begin with this lip pencil from Laura Mercier. And for lipstick, I will be using this one from Bobbi Brown. And to finish everything, I'm just going to set it with this face mist from Omorobitsa. And we're done. And there you have it, my forest fantasy inspired look. Definitely not your everyday makeup. But then again, that really depends how you do your makeup. So this is something that you could totally rock if it is something that is up to your alley. Thank you so much for tuning in and I hope you enjoyed watching this video as much as I love doing it. And as always, if there is a look that you want me to create for you, just put it down in the comment section and I will try my very best. Also, feel free to follow me on my Instagram. It's somewhere in here. And while we're at it, please consider giving this video a thumbs up. Consider subscribing and turn that notification on so you will be notified when a new video comes up. I hope to see you again on my next one, but until then, always remember, keep believing in magic and be kind to yourselves. Bye!